This is Halo 2 top 25 best 4v4 and then skill. So now, is this based on individual skill or is it going to be we're going to be basing this upon this like This is based and on money? who you're most scared to play in a 4v4 game, not a 1v1. Okay. But like obviously so, play like you know play like play play scenes and and so top two is going to be easy first. to pick. Yeah, like Elder Two, Elder One, stuff like. Yeah, the team team final yeah. final boss strong side is going to be interchangeable with same because of the team switch. Yeah. We're gonna do most scary to play. Wait, how do I even do this? I, I don't have like even a list to look at. But, like, also, I you have... think about it this way too, though, because strong side might be lower because like strong here. side team with legends for a long time, and saying was with with the ogres for a longer time. Strong side wasn't even placing in top two until he joined final boss. Yeah, strong side finally. That's when he started doing good at Halo. Right. Was, what was the, was the first Halo team? Philadelphia O four. NBO. So Walshy, Ogre One, and Ogre Two have to be Tuger, top three. Tuger and B Man, what do you got? I, I, in my opinion, Ogre or uh, Halo Two O Seven, O like late O Six O Seven had the most amount of good players ever in Halo's history at competing at the event. You know what I mean? Mm. That is that, that how that's how I saw. It. Maybe I could be wrong, but like I couldn't say like in Halo Three at any of those MLGs that like these top forty eight players were like that good. You know what I mean? Like, okay, so Strong got like second and third with Carbon a bit. But well, maybe the they were pretty good. I don't know. Strong is up there, but Strong's like he spent a lot of his career like fighting to place top four until he got the you know when he played with Carbon he got yeah, second. He got third, yeah. Then, yeah, he fought a lot of his career fighting. Fal Fal Fonzie and Fallacy were definitely going to be up there too because of the fact that even though they they only won one tournament in the Halo Two, but the fact of the matter is they consistently were in top three for a very long time in their career. That's going to be later down the list, I think, because I don't think you could put Shook one in. The, not in the top 10 right now. I don't think you could put Shook one in the top 10 right now. T2, number 17? Wow. Yeah. I, T2 sense. is definitely... No, I mean... Eh, T2, I can't put it... I think T2 is like 15 to 10. You think? So? Yeah, but he has to be there. Yeah, in my opinion. Wow. So I think. I think, I think that, that, kind of, by that I logic, know. I feel like who Crossy and Shotzi are about to be 10 to 15. I agree with your Ogre, too. Actually, I think he nailed it. I don't think Shook One is not individually because you got the Luck Twins that were way better than him, too. On that. And right, that's freaking... just, I'm going based on my small remembrance of who I saw dominating in Halo 2. That, that is what we're okay. going on. You guys need to help me remember. I'm just going to say All right, got you. 2. We got you. We got you. Gotta put the I gotta put Ogre One, Ogre Two, and Walshy. That's like top three easily. Should we put Walshy or or, two, or uh, Ogre One, Dan? Don't be biased. <laughs> or Tom, sorry. Should wait, sorry. I say Tom. Should we put Dan or? Walshie? I think Walshy's number three. Two. I think Walshy goes over Dan. I mean, yeah, other Dan, over over Sam for sure. Okay, here here we go, Tuger. Who's better, somebody on Carbon, or Saiyan, or Strong Side? At their very best, mm -hmm. like in peak put, zone performance, it probably depends on the event. It's pretty arguable. I put Shockwave honestly. Shockwave had in terms of moments. like Karma. I Karma's another good pick, honestly. Damn, because Karma that one v one individual good. skill. Karma's up there. I might have to put Karma up here because of his one. Karma's one up there, skills. bro. One hundred percent. Karma was ridiculously good in Halo too. I mm -hmm. saw what was it? It was two thousand seven Dallas. Karma was like fucking super saiyan at the event. Shockwave has to be top five. Or was that There's no way he shouldn't. Gandhi can't make top five because the fact of the matter is is that we're also incorporating all the Halo 2 and Karma and Shockwave even has done better than Gandhi in all aspects of the game. So Where was Gandhi I gotta put like Shockwave over Gandhi. Before. So the first event of Halo 2 was top what? was the first event of Halo 2? Help me. Look that up. Was it 2000, Philly, 2004? So, it might have been Philly. I think that might have been the first one. But let me, I have to, don't confirm this yet. First Halo event, I think, was... Karma's got Halo more five. dubs than Strong Side. So, I'm going to put Karma here. And then I'm going to put Sand because he quit. Right? He No, he did play out. What happened to Sand? Yeah, he, he got dropped and then did hmm. that. He got dropped at the end of 06, I believe, right? Wait, no, why would I put Sand here? I gotta put strong side here. Yeah, so he got dropped out for 06, and then he got like a 17th and 33rd place, and then he just left Halo. Yeah. Strong for side, Halo yeah, that's two, a good. Though. I like that. I like that right there. Saiyan can be under strong. 
Stain could be up there. Yeah, I, I, long, I feel like Shockwave is still how a little good. Stain at Halo too. I don't remember how good Stain was. All I remember is him BXR my brother one time and on, on, on I think Shockwave <laughs> has to be next to Strong Side because Shockwave was also the strongest player on it. Like Shockwave has to be. I put him over Stain in terms of like like you know. He's a beast, bro. He went sixty. He, yo, he played eyeball. He goes sixty kills, bro. Like Shockwave is over. No, Shockwave's not over Kama. Uh, I'll put Shock. De Tuger, I need your help. This is your list. Yeah. You played this. We need. Yeah, we, 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 yeah. Dude, we need to get Elamite in here, too, because then he can, like, comment somewhat on Halo 2. More than somewhat. Yo, eight. Oh, I don't want to. I'll ask you that separately with, um, with your brother. I no think more. Shockwave is really good. I'm going to put Shockwave, but Gandhi has the snipe. Shockwave had, like, the cape of the fucking team play. He was just a raw slayer, too. Like, Shockwave can literally just outslay, like, everything. I have to, yeah. And then should I put Saiyan here because he has a lot of good placings? One, 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 two, two, I two, put, three, four, I put Saiyan under Gandhi, in my opinion. But he could be interchangeable because Saiyan... I put Gandhi under Saiyan, actually. So I put Saiyan under Shockwave, and then I put Gandhi under that. Because Saiyan, you can't count... You can't discredit Saiyan for the fact that he was on the freaking most freaking powerful team in Halo 2. So... And putting him under Gandhi was unfair. I put Shockwave over him because he's literally the best player, like the second best player on a freaking show. Legit instead of Gandhi? Legit? Legit they go off. But Gandhi was able to keep himself placing higher, and that might have been due to his team, but Gandhi also made very he was an incredibly smart player. Also, Gandhi's actually a good 1v1 player. He just didn't like playing them. So Gandhi has to go over legit. Yeah, I gotta take Gandhi over legit. Mm-hmm. I don't know. I don't even know where to put Saiyan here. Too great. I need your help. I wouldn't know. <sighs> I'd put Saiyan over, like I would say Saiyan. Like, like, you got to say, like, oh, dude, did he stop caring? You know, did he stop trying? Was he playing WoW? Was he, you know, was he playing Warcraft 3? Like, I think Saiyan should go over Gandhi and under Shockwave. On to Halo 3 already. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay, we're going to do top oh, 15 Oh, God, that's me. Exactly. <laughs> Come on, B-Man. I, I need you helping me on these, these 7 to 15 play the spots, bro. Yo, best man, pick your picks, man. Yeah, yeah. You were you were fucking relevant. I remember your team with Eli. Oh my god, I think I coach. Oh, it's right. I had to coach these guys. These guys were freaking fun as hell to um the um freaking room with. I put Sand. Sand. That's what I'm saying. I think Sand yeah, has to be up there. There's no way you can omit him from any of this. And I think. Above Gandhi or below Gandhi? I think he's above Gandhi. Sand is above Gandhi. One of the best Halo Two players, like especially at the end of the game. You're neighbor is not up there right in the list yeah, again because of the fact neighbor, that okay. he wasn't relevant until later in the game, until when yeah, he joined no, yeah. Ripley. But can't put you can't put him up there yet. Yeah, neighbor wasn't like like yeah, neighbor wasn't no, like that. Yeah. Who am I missing? I, Who? You're missing T Square. T Square. T Square has to be over there. It's, yeah, and actually, you have to include Fonzie and Fallacy too. Nah, Fonzie Fallacy suck. Fonzie and Fallacy have to be there. They're with him because Fonzie was a consistent. Also, he was a consistent FFA placer. Ponzi was decent, but I'm talking about who's going to do more damage in a 4v4 game. Peak, like, middle of 07. Not, okay. like, I mean, like, fucking I mean, when nobody was... Oh, middle of 07. 07. Okay, we're doing the 07 year. That's different. All right, T2 so... has to be higher. I would say T2 is higher than, like, Neighbor and Elamite and legit. Yeah, T2 definitely, because he was, a, he was the main slayer for the team as well, too. So, like, that was a big thing. Neighbor's definitely there because if you're speaking of 07, Neighbor was on that team. Bro, I'm talking about who who got good at Halo 2, who was going to go more positive in a, in a finals match. I don't think Fonzie oh. and Fallacy are going to go more positive in a finals match than anyone listed, so I'm not putting them in. No, no, I agree with that, too. Like, I, I actually will say that. I agree yeah. with that. Uh, shit, you had, like, fucking Native Legit. You had, I would say, Hokum was anchoring fucking um, 5K. Fear Roy and what you know, fear itself. Like uh, fucking Poon. Well, Poon looking, was anchoring Native um, and legit. I would say. Like right, so, we got thirteen. This list is actually. Yeah. I like this list actually. Native. Native has to be up there. Native went off during all seven. That's actually probably. I would say that's his best year in terms of Halo Two. Yeah, Native has to be on this list. I agree with this. Yeah. There is no site that has like stats for any of these tournaments. Is there? I actually. Doing a lot of anal like I did a stream when I was analyzing a lot of the Halo 2 tournaments. And I actually I'm I'm a nerd when it comes to like knowledge in the game. So like I'm actually not even basing this on my opinion. I'm really just basing this upon I mean partially, obviously, but 
just doing it upon like research and just me watching uh native native should be up there it was luck bonfire was better than it was luck so by far bonfire was a better player now do you put zio somewhere on the list not over not, not in halo 2 not over like- not over bonfire or killer n no absolutely not zio's fell off not 100 percent, but zio's was the objective player we get that but like bonfire was their freaking like that strong slayer samurai no samurai doesn't make that list unfortunately captain anarchy oh man carlos that's a name i haven't heard in a while you can he can maybe what do you put ghost at? where would ghost be oh ghost ghost is a, ghost. ghost can't forget about ghost, ghost yeah. and ghost i would not want to play against ghost. ghost here oh Over yeah the, uh, defy anybody like defy wasn't terrible Defy also Defy also snagged himself him a good posi- a position because Defy was consistently placing top four for a while. Alright guys, I'm gonna throw it in the biggest surprise ever. Go. Who are you gonna say? Who are you gonna say? <laughs> legend? No. Legend fucking play no, get out of here. Get that legend shit out of here. No, you're not getting legend in here. Get the fuck out of here, dude. Legend is good in legend. 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 No, somebody said in your chat. No, somebody said in your chat legend. No way. Get the fuck out of here, dude. <laughs> no, you know you talking I about currency. G Spot might be the best Halo Two player I've ever seen. I'm just kidding. I just saw that name on this list. Ooh, you can't forget about How did about they get away with games? that? How did they get away with that name? But then here's the thing, though. If you're saying G Spot, <laughs> what about Mac? Eight? What about Matt, though? Okay, you're another one. Don't say Eli the Ninja. You're fired. Yo, get out of You're fired, bro. <laughs> Now you guys are trolling, Butters, bro. You Ray, guys are literally Ray Bash. Defy Bash gun. is a good pick, but he's another one. But I would still put Mac eighteen eighty one over Bash. Who was Legend Jerry's team? Piracy was Piracy on that team. Legend it was Piracy, Piracy Ray. Butters, and um, and um Rio. Rio was the other one, and then he changed his name and um to the to the R word, Dirt McGirt. And Halo Two Ogre Two, really? You want to put him in the top? <laughs> I'm thinking of random names. Like, Remember Smoke? Fucking, uh... That's a, who am I thinking of? Oh, you're talking about old IGS who, days. Who was that guy, that team with, uh... He Eli was. Mike. No, Ogre 2 was right. Bert was on Legend JRG's team. He was. That was him. It was, it was him. It was the kid Rape, and that's not the word Rape, but that was just literally the gamer tag, and that's just what it is. And it was, um... What's the other kid's name, man? That was on their team. That was with the fourth. I can't remember. Who was that other guy that... That quit, but it was the worst. Who did that call that uh that team with Elamite? Fit, fit, Which fit, year are you fit, talking about? Yeah. Which year, yeah. Like 2006. 2006 with, with Elamite? Fosic. Uh, Fosic. Yes, Fosic and Smoltz. It, holy <laughs> shit, I forgot about Fosic, dude. What a name. Oh my god! It, I'll wait for somebody to say right. donut. All right, let's get to twenty-five. Donut. Let's get to twenty-five. <laughs> who 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 are we filling in the next best player? B man, B man, B man. Next best, Legendary G. Legendary G is solid, but I don't know if he's next best. Legendary G actually was Batman. consistent. Who's consistent? Legendary G. Batman, Defy, All right, Defy for sure. Defy has to be on that list. He has to be. Yeah. Fake cheese. Has to be somewhere on that list. All right, let me. I gotta. I gotta. Me. I gotta. Um. Give you on the main screen, so you have yeah. This is actually really, this is good. Yeah, the five fake titties. I forgot about him. I mean, do you put Fonzie and Fallacy at like the last two spots or no? Yeah, yeah, somewhere. They're in there. Definitely top twenty-five. Rio, like, Fire is hot. Snowboarder five. Rio, Pistola, Pistola for sure. Just because he it was Pistola's on the list. And moves he, in FFA. Yeah, and then he move. Ah, Holly. All right, who else? Hysteria. I don't want to play hysteria like right there. Roy and launch, bro. I forgot. Of course. Wait, yeah, you can't be. Hey, you can't forget about Roy. Fucking launch. Yeah. Roy launch and fear Fist. itself was another person who was fear itself. Ola. Hey, what about no. Killer N? How easy, dude! MVP, how easy going off on the main stage, bro? Top eight MVP. Have to kill- Didn't he get MVP and he got eighth place mm-hmm. or something? Yo, Killer N does have to go into top twenty-five. B man. Oh yeah, Killer N. Killer- yeah, Killer N has to go in. Right. Killer N. And I put a bonfire up there too, actually. Bonfire. Luck. 
How easy. Does Pat K belong on the top 25 for Halo 2? Samurai, 650. Over Ziles? Ziles. Oh yeah, that's okay. Number 40, okay, good. All right, I'm about to say, I don't want to put him up there just <laughs> yet. <Yeah. laughs> I was like, no, maybe not that. <laughs> it was luck, bonfire. Yeah. It's looking at that all time H. I need your help, Tuker. You were gone when I was filling this out, man. I don't yeah, know who's gonna. Yeah, I didn't, I didn't play these players, but Slim. This is an 07 list, yeah. So it that's is kind of an 07 list, time, just because yeah. I think 07 is the most fair to, to look at, considering everybody had two years to play and get good. Yeah, because there's a lot of players that played in 06 <laughs> that literally just didn't do well in 07. And I said the same thing. Fonzie and Fallacy have to be up there. They have to be on that list, bro. I said the same thing. Uh, you can't take away that straight ripping I mean, legacy, bro. What should we do? Top all time H two, or should we do O seven fire? If it's fire all time, then Fonzie and Fallacy have to be up high, oh, then because guys. they all literally time, Fonzie and definitely have to be on the list. And Ziles too, because oh, Ziles has actually won an H two tournament. That's what do we like want to do? Do we want to do an all-time Halo 2 or a fucking best at Halo 2 in 07? I don't know. Ask your chat. See what they want to do. I mean, if you're doing, if you're doing best in Halo 2 at 07, then, like, yeah, that's... Devin, heavy into this. The list is pretty good for best at 07. 07 is a different list because all time, I would def I think this list would change a little bit because there were players that were shining as hell in 05 and 06. And literally, you know oh, what I'm saying? Yeah. So, like... Because that Fonzie and Fallacy did, like, good... We were all the way up until like uh oh, yeah, we'll to as hell. I'm not He's looking at any stats. I'm just trying to think like who who who's scary all caps in, in the game. And O oh, and O oh, in the beginning and end of O seven or I'd say last of end of O seven. Who's the scariest players? That's what we're doing. Top twenty five scariest. scariest all right, so there we go. That Top twenty five right. won the most individual battles in the game. Nate, should we just Nate, 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 he has to be up there. Yeah. It just didn't have a team to like get him. But Nady was scary, like, bro. Nady made Nady a lot of clips too. Yeah, exactly. Nady made some fucking nasty clips on it. Remember when they were doing the um like the top five clips for MLG, and like Pocket was doing the announcements for it, and Nady just had always had a clip. I wish I had more memory of the, these times. I, I do have some, but I remember paying X Factor. Yeah, so Poon is not on the list because. Well, his poon. What's Victoria's Secret? Victoria's Secret? I'm top 5, 2006. <laughs> I'm top oh, 5. Victoria's Secret? I remember that team. How about Ogre 3 and Detach? No, he's not. Nor is Detach. Detach was average. He 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 managed. He placed. Don't get me wrong. He had a top 4 placement, but he's not on that list. Yeah, I team with Ogre 3. Ogre 3, yeah. He was, a, he was decent, but he's not, like, top. Like, no, like... He's like a tier, I'd put him on like a tier two, maybe, like, you know, like maybe even closing to tier three. Defy is on the list already. Did I put him on there? I'm not seeing it. Uh, did you? Yeah, yeah, but let's say Defy is definitely on the list. Like, Karma number two, then Dallas Karma is number two. So, well Karma won the Dallas event, but in terms of like the scariest people, like, Karma's top four, so McGavin, he's already up there, yeah. Ray, McGavin. Yeah, Ew, don't put a little poison on a freaking... Straight Sick? Who's Red Alert? Straight Sick was... Uh... That's Shockwave. Red Alert is Shockwave. Jeez, that was how Shockwave's did this dude, how did first you make, name. Yeah. How did this guy make this? This sounds like this would have taken fucking hours. This looks like... I don't understand why he put Red Alert separate from Shockwave. He should have just added that. Like, I don't understand. That's why I said earlier. I was like, why? Like, literally... Yeah, he made a never separate name. That's stupid. Yeah, like, he's literally the same person. Damn, Twilight, Creepy Trash, Flankster, Flankster V2. Holy yo, I remember Flankster, yo. That was a freaking epic Welcome thing. Mellows, okay. Piracy, Aptitude, Ooh, Randa. I can't remember. Dark Vegito Randa, Randa? and freaking Mellows and all these guys. Vegito, I remember those guys. Light King, Prototype, mm -hmm. Arcane. I remember that team. I went to my first event with Mellows in them, actually. Piridious. That was my first ever Halo 2 event. Tom Ace. I, Mello, what was, yo, what was that gamer tag in Halo 2 and like Rumble Hardcore? Something like Tom. Rolled like Tom. Tom, not Tom DeBomb. It was like. I forgot. Anyway, I'm waiting for somebody about? to say muter in this chat because at this point you guys are just throwing out names. So like you just say muter. Rumble Hardcore Halo 2. Somebody good with Tom in the name or something. Pippi Trash getting goosed by Ninja. It's but Ninja will never make this Halo 2 list, so. There's the list. 
Loken methods just I put, are I freaking ninety nine. Not Chubby not over tight. Ninja in Halo Two. Like, there's a lot of names Foxy. I would throw over Ninja in Halo Two. Taku, Mudvayne. What about Hokum for Halo Two? Individually, I wouldn't be too scared to play against him at all. Legend RG. Who was Legend RG's team in 07? He's a good team player, but no, not individually. Like, I wouldn't put him on, no. What was Legend RG's team? Best Man? I love Best Man. Scary player? I wouldn't, I mean, I'd be scared to play against him, but I wouldn't put him on the top 25. Just not yet. I mean, I'd be more scared to play against Eli the Ninja, but Best Man fucking took off during his freaking Halo 3 career, and I freaking love that. Who else? Hmm. Thinking of another player, because if you can say best man, you can say havoc. You can say a lot of players. Like you have a city and mimic, all these other guys. You know, the city and that's the one player I remember. I be I I, I played against the city and one of my no. With Eli the Ninja was not good enough for top twenty five. Absolutely not. I like this top twenty five. Should we keep going? Eli who, Ninja who am I missing? Not top 25. Who, who was on Legendary's team, guys? I need help. I don't remember. I mean, he has some full ass montages though, and it's freaking. Mimic and Havoc? Yeah, they had a really good strong team. I agree with that, but we're talking about top, like, we're putting in the top 25. It's hard for really to put them in that right now, just because if we're comparing, like, the, you know, just... Who, who am I missing right after Slim. Ooh, Slim Bonfire that's a good Pirates. team. Slim Bon... Ooh. That's true. Can't forget about Slim and Dirt... You know what? Ogre 2 has a good point. Dirt McGurk was on that team. I think we... Yeah, that's very true. Dirt McGurk held it down. The oh NV team. No. Unlegit. Wasn't that... Isn't that Eco? Yeah. Pretty sure that's Eco, right? Unlegit? Can somebody in the chat confirm this? Yo, it is you. Yeah, it is you, Eco, isn't it? <laughs> you little sneaky bad. It was his original name, yeah. Here we go. Best man making the top 30 <laughs> cutoff of Halo 207 <laughs> Legends. Him. Look at all these legends. Ogre one two, Ogre two one. Walsh, Karma, Strong, Shock, Gandhi, Sane, Legit, Nated, Ghost, Neighbor, T Squared, Elamite, Victory, Macchio. I want to see what Elamite thinks about this. Roy or T Squared, Roy Lunch, Fizz, Killer, and Buffered Luck, Defy, JRG, Slim, Piracy, Power, Easy, Havoc, Mimic, Bass Man. That is the top 20, 30 best <laughs> no way, players. That's of what all made me think about. I was like, yeah, definitely two thousand seven. 